Hey guys, how's it going? It's your boy Jerry 718 back at you again. And today I got another unboxing for you. Uh, this is for a system that I've done in the past, but I've not actually covered this version of it. Um, sure, I've, I've gotten I think the multicolored and gray version of ones. I probably give it away, huh? I've got a multicolored version two, um, and a I've got a, a Pikachu edition. I think they were version ones. I'm not sure. And then I got the uh, Animal Crossing version two. Um, but this one here I've never owned. Uh, the only reason that I got it was um, because I, I find myself playing more, playing it more out of um, on handheld mode than docked and um, I'm pretty sure you probably already know what I'm talking about um, but I did end up picking up an OLED um, before I start that though I uh, I want to tell you about today's sponsor uh, psych I don't have sponsors so um, anyway I do want to tell you something though. Uh, pretty much, uh, the reason I started playing in dark mode was because I I don't have any um, any more HDMI <laughs> ports on my TV. And um, the thing about the OLED, which I, I I could never understand, was that the scalpers were even scalping them. These, whatever. Uh, I don't know why uh, there's a couple on Facebook marketplace right now in my area uh, basically somebody wanted it was um it was a cheap uh, carrying case like the Mario Rabbids game which you can pick up for most of the time is 20 bucks sometimes 60 but 95% of the time it's 20 bucks. Um, and the, the case they have for it, I think not even, uh, even if it's 20 bucks, okay. Uh, that's about what, I don't know. Let's say 480 with, or uh, about, I don't know, close to 500, something like that. But I mean, they're selling they're selling them for so much, and it's OLED switches. I mean, sure, you know, it's the next new thing. It, well, it was the next new thing, but I mean, it's never going to compare to the PS5 and uh, Xbox Series X. Um, just like the the Series S. I mean, you could find the Series S everywhere pretty much at least around here you can um but i just uh i don't know why they they were doing the uh oleds like that because i mean it's a switch uh, but uh anyway after that long boring story uh, basically it's the same thing here uh tabletop docked handheld you know blah 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 uh, like I said I have not actually owned one of these nor have I really even I don't even know how to open it but I think I found it out um, I actually know that I've seen one at Be uh, not Best Buy um, actually yeah Best Buy and GameStop um, I haven't Test it really. I didn't even really look at it all that much, because uh, I, I had, like I said, I mean, I still even have my uh, my Switch box, and I'm a dumbass because I could have, I could have probably sold this for about two fifty, and I traded it in at GameStop. GameStop gave me one hundred forty three dollars for it. And I'm a dumbass, but I mean, 
I don't know. I just didn't want to deal with that. I, I, I don't know. The Joy Cons are really nice. Um, I mean, it, it to me right now. The uh, it looks about the same, but I I, I know it's almost an inch bigger than the original Switch. Oh, the original in version 2, whatever. Uh, but the difference is is uh, this, this kickstand is way bigger. It's the, it's the length of this whole Switch, pretty much. Uh, instead of that little tiny one like this. Uh, so I, 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 I don't... The only reason I don't take it out of the... Um, Packaging is because I don't trust myself until I get the screen protector on, which I did actually uh, get to. Uh, like I said, I uh, I don't trust myself. But uh, I mean, this is it's pretty much the old same standard stuff. Um, you got the uh, the dock, which is. I don't know, man. This thing feels way flimsier than the other one. Yeah, see? This thing is, I don't know, dude. I, I might have wasted my money on it. Because the, the, uh, at least the other one on the other Switch uh, this part stayed on. Uh, I mean, it, it came down like this, but at least it stayed on the system. So, right there, I don't like that part. But, I mean, I'll live with it, I guess. I'm not really going to be putting it in here to, unless I charge it or whatever. I'm not going to be opening up the back anyway. It's just, I don't know. Here's the um, HDMI cable. Um, yeah, I forgot to smell it. Uh, the charging cable. I don't know why I never take these out. I mean, I better take them out anyway, I mean. I mean, it, and it's kind of crazy because um, those used ones at like GameStop are only ten dollars cheaper. I mean, it, it's like it's not even worth getting a used one at that point. You might as well buy it new because you know they all they do is test it for. I don't know the the guy where I live. He he didn't even play the game like he said he saw that the cartridge was there uh because i i had um uh, i think he tested uh xenoblade chronicles on it and i already had that installed and so like he didn't even make sure you know to put a game in there that you know it, it i didn't have on it so that it reads it or anything. And see, that kind of made me think about, well, that's probably why 50% of the things that you get at GameStop are crap. Use, use systems, 50% of them, to me, are crap, if not more. Because they, they just don't, I mean, And then, like, he didn't even test the, the Joy-Cons either. Because uh, the Joy-Cons, the, you got them on the Switch screen that you can, you know, make sure that there's no drift or anything like that. And um, never even tested those to make sure that those didn't have drift or anything like that. I mean, it, it works. You know, I know you guys probably like, well, drip, dude. Uh, 
I, I kind of realized that I said Dreb718 on my at the start of the video, and I'm sorry about that. Uh, but anyway, uh, I was like, Dreb, what are you doing? Trading in trash? No. <laughs> I don't trade in trash. I, uh, I trade in working things. Uh, I don't believe in trading in something that doesn't work. Uh, if I actually have something that doesn't work, I'll tell them. I'll be like, hey man, uh, I'm gonna let you know right now, the blah, blah, whatever it is, it doesn't work. I'm not gonna beat around the bush. I'm not gonna, you know, sit there hoping that they don't test it because it's me. No, I'll say, hey, uh, uh, the disk drive isn't reading disks or whatever it's doing, not doing or not doing, you know. Uh, most people, you know, they, they know that it's not working and they're like, when they get, when they get it, I just, I, you know, I, I sit there and, and I'm like, uh, and when people come in and trade, you know, 95% of the time, you know, everything goes, goes smoothly, no problem. But, I mean, you get that person that comes in, and sometimes they don't know. You know, it's like, oh, dude, this has been sitting in storage. I don't know if it works. You know, and that's fine. You know, I've had that happen to me before, too. And then you get the, the, the person that comes in and says, oh, my God, I didn't know it didn't work. Uh -huh. <laughs> And you could tell that they're lying about it. And it's like, dude, I mean, you had this person sit there and hook all this up full-blown knowing that it didn't work. And, I mean, you just costed this guy. You just costed, you just cost this person more, you know, time that he could have been helping somebody else because... You know, he, he could have saved them. Hey, man, whatever was wrong with it, hey, this this isn't working. What they do is they refurb it, and then they put it aside. They don't have to hook it up. They don't have to do anything, you know. I mean, they, they still do most of the time because, you know, maybe, maybe they were wrong, and they had two. And they brought the other one in, and the one sitting at home is like that. They sold this guy. They took, they sold GameStop a working one, but they told him it was. Now, yeah, but I I don't know. I'm I'm done with my rant. I'm sorry, guys. Oh yeah, I just find it because I I had that that I saw that the other day. I went into buy. Uh, I actually traded in a. Uh, I don't know, some games and stuff. And I ended up buying uh, a couple of PS5 games. And uh, the guy beside me, or the person beside me, traded in a, an X, like an Xbox One. And I like how they shake them now. I, I didn't know that because I, you know, it had been a while since I'd been inside the game stuff. I usually just have them curbsided to me. But, I mean, they shake the systems. And if stuff, stuff falls out of it, they don't take it. Which is good for them. But, uh, the guy, it was one of those people. Oh, my God. I didn't know it wasn't working. Yeah, you did. <laughs> you knew it wasn't working. You just didn't, you decided not to tell the guy. To see if maybe they would. But they test it no matter what. Unless you tell them that there's a specific problem with it, uh, they will test all the, uh, the things that come in. Sorry, guys. We have uh, a big termite problem here. Like, the, the termites are swarming. And I just, I don't know. But anyway, 
All right, guys. Uh, I will see you guys later, and I will make another video about why I decided to change my name. But um, all right, guys. Peace.